Natalie Collada is at the First Nation area and joins us now in that community. Natalie, uh, what do you know so far? Well, what we can tell you is this was, as you said, it's supposed to be a very peaceful day, a day of a celebration of sorts. There was a group of about 200 individuals who were walking uh, down the road towards the camp here, hoping to once again reclaim it, to walk in and to return back home, as they have said after many years of fighting to get this land claim. On the journey, when the crowd of about 200 was about two kilometers away, my camerawoman and myself came to the finishing destination where we saw a group of individuals who had built a small fire uh, in protest, not wanting to accept what had happened and accept these individuals who were coming in upset about the deal. We talked to them about that. Then it escalated. Individuals who were for this resolution and against the resolution within the same band started arguing. It degenerated and then somehow an individual was caught on fire. Now that individual was taken away to the hospital. Uh, he was conscious at the time and there was still tension between the two crowds here as they tried to move forward together as a community, but they still escalated a lot of hurt at you here, a lot of pain still here in uh, southern, southwestern Ontario.